Uh, this is a quick setup run through for the Wattie Geek Design Shift Light. I've already installed this one in uh, as per the installation instructions. The first thing we need to do is to start the car. Okay. So now there's a button at the top. We double push that and that will put us into config mode. The first mode is the display mode. Each press of the button converts it or changes it into the next display sequence and then at double press you'll see flashing lights uh, that's telling you the max RPM now what we do is we set the revs to half of what we want so I'll set it to 3000 RPM and press the button so that's I set it at 3000 and that means a red line or it will start flashing at anything above 6000 RPM double press again you will now see half of it fill up this is telling us this is the minimum revs mode if you want to display all the way through the rev range just press it here um, if you wanted to only start lighting up when you're getting close to the rev range you set your revs to where you want it displayed for example 4000 rpm push the button and that will be where it starts displaying from at this point we can either double press it and it's now gone into standby mode or we can just sit back and wait for 20 seconds and it will automatically revert back to standard mode. Now if I rev it, you can see it starts up. Uh, if you want to change the brightness level, all you need to do is single press it when it's in standby mode. So that's the lowest setting, that's the dim day setting and that's the sunny day setting. And that's it, simple as that.